What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Sir House of Jazz. Jazz. The piano tutorial man. All right, y'all. So you already know what we're here to do today. We have the classic Murray J. Blige song. Not Lionel Richie, but Murray J. Blige is all night long. Nice little groove here. So we're going to uh, work this out real quick. Uh, not too many chords. So here we go. All right. So what you want to start with is um, the main chord that you're playing. I'm going to show you these three main chords. Then I'm going to show you the bass line that you need to rock with it. Okay. So you want to do this F minor nine. Okay. So you got F on the left hand, A flat, C, E flat, G. Then you want to go to G minor 7, which is G on the left hand, G, B flat, D, F, and then you want to go to, this is a C dominant 7 with a flat 9, that's C on the left hand, G, B flat, D flat, E. These are the three basic chords that you plan throughout most of the song. It's going to be... Now, here's the thing about it. Of course, if you want to play the song right, you got to rock that bass line. So this is what we're doing if you want to do it. If you can if you can manage to rock your left hand while holding the chords, this is what you want to do. You want to hit F. And then you want to bounce to this E flat and come back to the F. So you want to go bop. But up, and then you want to hit the E flat and F again, and this time add a F sharp or G flat and move over to G. So you're gonna go bop, ba da, ba da, ba ba, ba 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 ba. I'm sorry, ba 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 ba. Mess that up, ba da, ba da, ba da. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da -da. So again, I didn't call out all the notes, so let me call out all the notes again. Is F, E flat, F, E flat, F, F sharp, G, then jump all the way down to this B flat to C. Hit the C twice. Ba -da -da. Then you want to walk from B flat, C. E flat and then that's the and then you're back on the F again. So look at it slowly. Bop ba da ba da ba da ba da da ba da 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 I'll do it one more time. And this is what it sounds like if you're playing the chords with your right hand. You go. Got it? That's most of the song right there. Oh, I messed up. Pretend I didn't hear it. <laughs> That's it. You're playing that for most of the song. There is a little bridge there, but that's it. So just practice that again. Your main chords, F minor 9, G minor 7, C dominant 7 with a flat 9. That makes it the flat 9 right here, this D flat. And then you just rock it. So you start with the F, bop, ba da Ba -da -da -da. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da. It's most of the song. Now there's a section of the song where it goes to like a bridge. It does it two times. I guess it's like the B section, or or what you what you might call it the pre-chorus. I guess it goes like this. Then you go right back to All 
right, so let's take a look at that. So that change, you're doing an A flat minor nine. A flat on the left hand, uh, B, E flat, G flat, B flat. And then just take your left hand, move it over to D flat. So you can kind of, even though technically is, you can think of it that you're doing like an A flat minor uh, over D flat. What does it say on the screen over there? What they call it, a D flat 13 something? I can't see y'all. Uh, for those of y'all, I've lost a lot of my vision. But um, to be honest with you, this is just a one, three, five. So this is a B major seven on the right hand so you can look at it as b major seven over uh c sharp or over d flat you can look at it that way so okay so you got then take your left hand go back to the a flat again and then this time you want to come to the this is a d flat dominant nine chord so D flat on the left hand, then you're going to do B, E flat, F, A flat. And then you're going to do a different inversion of the C dominant 7 flat 9. So it's the same chord we played before, but instead of playing the G down here, when I showed you the chord before, we played this G. I just moved the G up here because just because it's easier to... Uh, move to that chord from if you're playing oh my goodness that's the wrong chord now i don't forgot what the chord is uh messing with y'all i don't forgot what the chord is so okay there we go all right so when you're coming from this chord <laughs> it's easier to just go from there to so that's the reason why i did that inversion right there so again c on the left hand b flat d flat e g and ladies and gentlemen, that's the whole song. You go right back to your bop. But I, but I, da, 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 I think they do go to an E flat real quick, like boom. They can go back to the A flat. And then it's. And back to. So hopefully, ladies and gentlemen, that helped you out. That is the entire song. So, um. I appreciate y'all checking out this video. If you haven't uh, subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. Make sure you also click that like button. And um, I guess I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace.